In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to burn multiple tracks to a CD from your MixCraft project. We will be doing this by using markers. When you start a project in MixCraft, a marker is automatically placed at the beginning and it will be called Start. If you right click on that marker and click Edit, name the marker the name of your first song. Notice that the Create Track for CDs or Audio Files box is automatically checked and you cannot uncheck it for the first marker. And let's say we wanted our second track to start here, so we want to right click, Add Marker, type in the song name, make sure to check the Create Track for CDs or Audio Files box. And if you have an ISRC number, you can also check that and enter the number. And our third track will go right around here. Make sure to check the box. And to get these precisely where we want them, we'll zoom all the way in. Let's say that was the start of our third track. And then we click File, Burn to CD. Mixcraft wants to know if we would like to save our changes. Yes, we would. The rule of thumb would be, the slower you burn the CD, the better the burn. If you would like to create CD text, and your burning hardware supports it, click Create CD Text. Type in your artist, an album, or whatever you would like to appear. And after creating the CD, your players should display the CD text when you play this CD, provided the players also support CD text. Then we simply click Start Burn. 